This video discusses the Unreal Engine landscape and world composition terrain scales for matching height maps to specific dimensions and altitude ranges. The Unreal Engine uses a world scale of 1 unit equals 1 centimeter. For example, the actor properties for location are all in centimeters. Height maps for Unreal Engine landscape and world composition can be created algorithmically or obtained from digital elevation models. For digital elevation models, I recommend not using anything less than 1 meter data if at all possible. Digital elevation data that is up to 10 meters can often still be scaled down to 1 meter and still look fine on most terrain shapes. It just brings the detail such as mountains in closer, which is often desired in limited area game levels. Height maps should always be normalized to the full 16-bit range before importing into Unreal Engine. This is to eliminate the aliasing stair-stepping that can occur if the number of data bits is too low. The default landscape import scale values are 100, which is 1 meter per XY vertex and 100% of 512 meters for the Z scale. This results in a landscape terrain that is 1 meter per quad with an altitude range of 512 meters. The Unreal Engine uses the following landscape scale factors for all imported height maps. For example, a 505 by 505 height map at a scale XYZ of 100, 100, 100 results in a 505 by 505 by 512 meter terrain. The PNG 16 or RAW 16 16 bit height map data is divided by 128 to obtain the final 512 centimeter scale. A normalized height map that is using the full 16 bit 0 to 65 535 data range results in a terrain mesh that is 512 meters tall when the scale Z is 100. So, therefore, with a normalized 16 bit height map file, to obtain an altitude range of 256 meters, the landscape scale Z would be set to 50. And to obtain an altitude range of 1024 meters, the landscape scale Z would be set to 200. Unreal Engine World Composition has the landscape levels scale XYZ specified during tile importing. These values cannot be changed after the import. They are fixed in the tile's landscape streaming proxy properties. So it is imperative to get the scale Z value correct when importing the tiles. Otherwise the entire tile set has to be deleted and re-imported. TerraSculptor can be used as a method to visually determine the Unreal Engine World Composition Tile Importer Scale Z value. When TerraSculptor is set to the same units as Unreal Engine in the Settings dialog, the viewports will match up between the two applications. So the Scale Y value in TerraSculptor can be used for the same Scale Z value on the Unreal Engine World Composition Tile Import dialog.